79th and 24th and uh, now we're just able to see through the dust a lot of onlookers are here Walter Bush the former president of North Stars is here Tom Reed is here interesting I talked to a uh, interestingly I talked to a lot of people such as Lou Nanny and uh, and uh, Al Shaver the former longtime play-by-play -play voice and he was saying he could not come and watch this because it was too emotional of a day for him to watch this building go down the west side of the building is still standing um, a good portion of the building is still standing it's now falling right now so it's starting we may have a chain reaction happening right here Tom Tom were you able to find out uh, what happened at all uh, not at this point apparently Anna Chong from uh engineered demolition the company that uh, is in charge of this uh, took off immediately uh, after the the charges and we do not know where she is she may be trying to determine what's going on herself so I was not able to uh, enlighten us at all from an official standpoint on what's going on do we know for a fact that all the explosives did go off as planned that's the one thing that I'm wondering about I don't know you know because as a backup plan in fact Anna called it her insurance policy was that in these steel beams that go up into the walls of the Met Center, they went with torches and cut uh, and made these special cuts that sloped inward.